back to the Screen Savers. I'm Leo Laporte, and Kevin is here. Yes, and we are coming up in this half hour, Grammy winning violinist, and believe it or not, super geek Joshua Bell is going to talk about how he can't stop playing Quake 3. That can't be good for his violin playing. Definitely and we'll take a look. His thumbs just got to. And we'll take a look at high tech music stand uh, that, is, uh, that has piqued the interest of Joshua Bell and Broadway as well. We've got a few open slots in our next game, by the way. So if you're ready to play Quake, and uh, should, are we going to. Should I give that out? You want me to give out yeah, that? Go ahead. Really? You have two slots. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You're brave. Let's Joy, do it. See, what happened is we sent out the emails to everybody, right. and a lot of these people hadn't upgraded yet, right? They so need 1.3 They were, 1 .3 they were messed up, so we right. didn't get everybody in there. We thought, all right, we're going to do it. We're going to slam the server. Let's do it. Go to Open Quake 3. TSS Land Party is the name of our party. I'm going to give you the password, Hugo2034. Now, it's only for this game, right? Just for this game. It's going to restart in 15 minutes. From so you've got 15 minutes yeah. to get in there, and then we change the password every 15 minutes. So if this kills us, we at least can 15 minutes from now recover. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Screensavers Weekly Land Party, the first night, opening night. Thanks to NVIDIA, they're powering this. And Kevin has been putting more hours into this in the last few weeks than anybody. Getting this, land, yeah, getting this land party. Server's full? That Server's didn't take very long. There we go. All right, so forget, it. forget Hugo, whatever. <laughs> it, it ain't going to help you anymore. Heron, are you still winning, Heron? For the time being, I don't think it's going to last. We've got, we've got the aces in there now. So, Kevin, tell me about what, what happened here, the whole process of setting up our land party. Well, uh, we had... First, you built some machines, right? First, first we got some machines. These uh, are the ones they're it, using over there? Correct. NVIDIA okay. provided us these machines for oh, cool. four boxes. Tell us the specs. What are, what's in the machine? Specs. Okay, we have an XP2100 Plus processor. Okay, that's nice the AMD processor. AMD processor. That is a fast processor. Is that their top of the line? Uh, 2200, Pat okay. would know. Close, to, close the, to the top of the 2200. line. Very fast. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. So fast that, as you can buy. Yeah, it's it's really fast. We have the Lead Tech motherboard, and that has the NVIDIA Enforce chipset. The Enforce chipset's in there. Uh -huh. Okay. But but we didn't use the Enforce native video. We're putting a top of the line of NVIDIA card right, in there. Right. Top of the line. It's the uh, let's it's, see the GeForce 4 Ti 4600. That's the best you can get. It's got, uh, We're using the Lead Tech in there. Yeah, Lead Tech. This thing is this thing is so hot look, that look it's that got its sink. own heat sink. And look at this, fans and everything. Those this engineers awesome. like have a contest to see who can make the biggest heats. I swear, <laughs> I think it's huge. All right. What kind of uh, a RAM did you put in these machines? Uh, we have a gig of RAM. A gig? A gig. Of, oh, why not? Uh, DDR, why not? <laughs> NVIDIA's paying for it. There you go. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's, thank you, guys. We appreciate it. A gig. Wow. And then a nice... You might say RAM is inexpensive. RAM's cheap. Oh, that's it. Buy that's it. more. <laughs> and... Uh, 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 well, how big a hard drive? You don't need that big a it's hard drive. It's an 80 gig. This is a, but this is a nice hard drive, though. The real fast one? It's a 8 meg cache hard drive. It's a new Western Digital Special See, that's Edition. That's important because when you load the game, you're loading it off the hard drive. The speed in the hard yeah, drive makes a big difference. Boom. And no we're changing problems. games every 15 minutes, so we need to have that load in pretty quick. This is true. Uh, and then the monitors, are, these are beautiful. Uh, they are. Nice NEC little multi-sync. Multi these yes. are the 1700s. I love them. I uh, love these a lot. And, uh, and so that's the, that's the kit uh -huh. that they put together. And that's what, we've got one system down so we can show you. Three and machines then back we've here. Got three, but eventually we're going to have four. Cause right I, after the segment, I'll hook this one right back up. I'm not we'll four players. Getting to You'll play. get in there. Okay. You'll get in there. This is my machine, in other words. I'll keep my fingers out of it. <laughs> now, we're not running the server here. No, we we're tried not. that before. We got hammered. We got hammered. I'm going to be honest. I mean, we just got hammered. We couldn't do anything. Right. I mean, we're on a... Because of so much traffic on right. our T1. Well, that we gave out our IP address. Which was a mistake. Never give out the Don't IP Don't give out your IP address because what is happening is people were pinging it. Oh, they were scanning in. us. They were yeah. denial of a service tax. You hackers, you, you get out of my system. Yeah. All right. So now we're, we're, we're at Rackspace? We're at Rackspace. Those now. guys are great. Where are they in Austin? Where are they? They are in San Antonio. San Antonio. Okay. And they've hooked us up to an OC48. So they're giving us uh, so much bandwidth that we, that we just have we have more than enough room for the games we're trying 2. to play. Two point four eight eight gigabits per second. <laughs> that's like twenty T1s. That's enough. That yeah. should do. That should be plenty for what we're going to do today. Yeah. And definitely. we're managing the server from here, though, right? We are. We are. We're How are we do, doing that? Well, I set up a Windows 2000 server, and I put uh, terminal services on it. That's the old Citrix. Uh, they they license Citrix, the, the, and that's running. So you can, so you can actually access administer the system. machine. Correct. Cool. I can even show you how I do Are it. Are we doing here. it from here? Yeah, I have one connected here. So you're logging into the, the, the uh, one of the systems this in, is our uh, server. in San Antonio. This is our server how right here. How big is the server that we're running down there? The is server it? we have down there is a 1.6 uh, gigahertz AMD Athlon. It's got a gig of RAM as well, 20 gigabyte hard drive, just your standard server. Okay. And it's handling. It's the bandwidth that's really. It's the bandwidth that's The server's really fine. We were testing this for a week, line. and the server's really plenty. Oh, it's great. Okay. We're running like 4% 4, 4 log CPU log usage, something like that. Because you've got a special program running on the server that allows you to mess with the Quake server, too, right? 
I do. This is... Uh, so now you're logged into San Antonio. Correct. And what I've done is I've set up separate configuration files for each of the games. Okay. So, and what we use so here... So you just double-click it? I just double-click it and it launches. I use okay. a little program here called uh, Quake 3 Runner. And what this allows us to do... Here, I'll full screen it here. Th this is pretty much designed to do what we're doing, which is running a remote server, right, basically? Exactly. Okay. And we can set the max number of clients, any of the options that we'd want to set. This is not from it. This is somebody else. No, else's. this is a third party. Just run at gameadmins.com. So you can choose free-for-all, tournament, and then you just click run, and it launches the server. Don't do that. Did you just do that? No, I didn't do oh, okay. it. We're good. But poor Robert Herron's winning. Yeah. We kick no, him he's off not. Line. He's yeah, in he's fifth line. place. Bobo wins. Bobo. Bobo won. Congratulations, Bobo. You're a winner. Oh, Bobo's good. Is Bobo good? Bobo's really is good. He, is he's he cheating. Threat? He's probably cheating. Yoshi's, Yoshi's nodding, which is bad. Now, well, now, wait a minute. We're not allowing cheating, are we? Well, Can there's you... a, there's a new patch that we're going to put on next week that prevents all cheating. Oh, so but, it's possible. Uh, to... It's possible. There's a couple little cheats Don't that they cheat. can get in there. Oh. Oh, I think everyone's honest here. Is everyone honest? Okay. okay. That's well, good. He's winning fair and square. Who's in second place? Mr. Strike? Yep. Mr. Strike, Wasabi, Wasabi, <laughs> and then uh, I can't even read that. What's in Haxers? Kill loser, kill loser. Oh, that's a good. <laughs> All right, that's a good name. All right, so there. So, the, so basically, even though this was the first thing that made us a little nervous, we don't have physical access to the server. Right. So if it goes down, we're what do we, we can call do? Rackspace. Though. Right. We have a guy there. I mean, they have great support. Yeah. Twenty four seven. They're geeks. Oh, they're geeks. Which is great. Total I geeks. mean, they understand what we want to do, and they and they and they really get it. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is, uh, now BQ server, what's that? Now BQ server is so that I can administer it no matter where I go, over the web. Oh, it's a web-based. It's a web-based. So you don't even need to do this terminal servers to run this. Exactly, I'll show you what it looks like here. This is BQ server running. You could change the game, you could change the I password. I can kick users out. Now, this kick is, users. I didn't refresh it here, otherwise it would show everyone in the room. But I can change the, the map if you click on here. This is really cool. Check this out. What, are we using just the stock maps? Are we going to put some cool maps in? We are going to put some cool maps All right. in. Right now we're using the stock maps so that everybody will have them. Exactly. And play with us. Exactly. They don't have to download don't have anything. To download All anything. Right. Cool. But uh, basically, you can choose the map. You can up the, the user limit from here. You can reboot the server remotely from anywhere. We're on our third round now. Is the server full, guys? Close. Let's see. Should I give out? It's pretty close to full. Oh, the server's full. I don't need to give out the, uh, the uh, new uh, password. All right. I won't do that. You want to see the specs to the client systems, the ones we're using to play? We got the greatest stuff here. Oh, that's great. Yeah, as you know, we're spending Paul Allen's money basically. <laughs> Check out the article at thescreensavers.com. And Nvidia's. Thank Nvidia's you, Nvidia. Trouble. Did I say thank you, Nvidia?